first started talking about um, the Vuitton exhibition in, I think it was January 2009, and um, the idea was to put together an archive of the clothing for the reopening of the Bond Street store in London. And it was to put the clothes together in a very contemporary way, so it wasn't like a retrospective, it was just um, a kind of representation of the clothing that they'd done over the, at the time it was 11 years. Um, but, it, but to put it together in a very kind of modern way so it didn't look like a museum exhibition. Whenever I think about Louis Vuitton, I always think that the woman is very together. She's always got a handbag, she's always got a high heel shoe on, she's always glamorous, foxy, sexy, always very French. So whenever I'm choosing a piece of clothing, I kind of try and remember all of those things all at the same time. Whenever I'm working on putting together an outfit, it's always very intuitive. Um, I mean, I think about proportion. I always like thinking about the hair or the hat um, and how that works with the shoe and then how to fill in the middle part. I think as long as you've got good hair and a good shoe, you can pretty much do anything in the middle. I think because I first started working on the exhibition so long ago now, you know, and we've done, I think we've done four new collections since then. So it felt really important to kind of add some, some new season things in there and just to change the styling a bit because it kind of has gone to three cities now and it was the same exhibition and I just wanted to kind of freshen it up a bit. Well it's kind of amazing to do an exhibition like this during Milan Fashion Week. You know when we first started talking about it two years ago, three years ago, I didn't for a minute think that it would end up being a travelling exhibition um, and I've been to some amazing places with it. Um, it's just a huge honour and it, it feels terribly grown up and um, really exciting.